A friend of mine and I discovered that the World Championships existed, and this was like 2002, uh, and that there were countries from all over the world sending their champions to, rep to represent the country, and the United States is not represented. And we felt like if there's one thing in the world that the U.S. should dominate without controversy, it's this. I think we're the best country. We've won the most world titles. We hold the world title now. Um, but oddly, we always feared Japan, and Japan's very good. But the strange one is France is the other one. So I'd say the U.S., Japan, and France are the superpowers in our guitar. Probably the judging criteria. The first one is uh, technical, like are you convincing us that you're sort of playing what we're hearing? Second is stage presence, so that's now harder. Like how many people that do that have the, are crazy or stupid enough to do it on stage with the whole well, hundreds of thousands of people watching? And then the last one is the hardest, which is the je ne sais quoi, airness factor. My name is Aristotle, and I'm the reigning 2016 World Air Guitar Champion. A friend of mine bought a, a, a DVD, it was a documentary called Air Guitar Nation, and it chronicled the first year that these competitions were taking place in the United States. The philosophy behind the competitions are that if everybody in the world were to hold an air guitar, theoretically you can't be holding a rifle, so boom, world peace. So I thought this was the craziest way to promote world peace that I'd ever seen, so I signed up for the next competition. You know, I'm the old guy, six times Mid-Atlantic champion. You know, getting up there, you just have to, you have to be technical. And that's when I started, I'm just like, that's all I was doing. But you have to create an art on stage. So you have to be very, very entertaining. involved in U.S. Air Guitar since 2003, but I still haven't won the big dance yet. So my wife, Mrs. Shred, will be here. If I ever win the U.S. Championship, I told her I'd retire. Wait, what brought you out tonight? Spur of the moment. We just walked by, and you said felt you it. Said yeah, we got to do it. What about you guys? What brought you out tonight? Groupon. Oh, Groupon. <laughs> Groupon brought me out tonight. Yeah. Are you guys ready to see some excellent air guitar tonight? Absolutely. Oh, yeah. yeah. Oh, are you? Is your husband Shred? Yeah. Yes. Yes. I know doing this on stage has been like at least the past ten years, but I think he's been playing air guitar for thirty years, maybe. It's a little weird. It's a little weird. Yeah. I, I don't. I don't really understand his like affection for the this, but. I'm here to support. Tell me, what's your inspiration? Well, you know, I just love these air guitar children. They are so precious, and it's kind of fun. It was great to be with all of the air guitar players from all over the U.S. and a camaraderie that we have. It's like mime, comedy, rock and roll. I love every aspect of it. 